Inspired by the rugged and mighty conditions of the nearby Rocky Mountains, the Colorado Avalanche will be on home ice tonight in Denver. Hi everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro coming up in just a moment. I'm Mike Emmerich and we have a situation here where a series might end tonight. Put yourself in the position of the team facing elimination. They're away from their home fans. Can't be easy. It is not, Doc, and, and I think talking to the team and the coaching staff is that I think that they're in a pretty good place. They realize that there is no tomorrow, and sometimes players and coaches react a little bit differently when their backs are against the wall, and certainly for this team, they are up against it. The Flames got to lay it all on the line in this elimination game. They have to play on their toes. They need to dictate the terms. They cannot be on their heels or their season will be over. Okay, so let's look at the starting goaltenders for the game. His team has seen success, could close this out tonight, but they can't take the pedal off the metal. They'll need to play just as hard if they want to take this one out. He comes into this one with a chance to finish the series. Let's see what he can do. McKinnon's a starter here. That means he is expected to set the tempo. I'm Mike Emmerich with Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro. This playoff game has started. Goes to the backhand. The lane was jammed and it hit somebody. Propel to Lindholm. Centering pass. Big takeaway. Skates it into the zone. Chip to Monahan. On to Lindholm. Muscled long to Giordano. And a save. Down near the players is Ray Ferraro. Now the real danger for the home team, Doc, is with all this emotion in the building, is to keep their composure, in particular, early in the game. Okay, Ray, thank you. Drop. They lock up, and that's a good job by the wingers. Rister from the slot. The glove like lightning. Calgary has got it again. That puck came free. Could have been handled better. Good place to shoot from, and he does. Wonderful stop. Terrific defensive work. The Avs are skating it up in neutral ice. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. Same side to Giordano. Laid on to Barry. Couldn't get through. It's loose. Flings it. He scores! So the celebrating comes early for the first goal. Always better to play from in front than to chase the game. There's the game's first goal. He's ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. And he gains the zone. Strong play there by Barry, directing that one to Soderbergh. Moving it to Calvin. Gains the zone. And it's a good pickup. And now it's directed to Ryan. Chooses the corner for this. Slid to Soderbergh. Shoots one. The shot is off. He was hoping for a little bit more with that chance, but his shot is just off the target. Pitching this one to Froley. Cut that off between the blue lines. Skates along the line. Great job in his own end with that interception. Feeds the point. 
A shot. That's a great glove save. He wore that puck on a hard shot. Shot. Oh, and a big save grab of the glove. And that one is held on to for a stoppage of play. This is a timely whistle, Doc. The goalie finally gets that puck after a lot of pressure in the zone. Just a tad under eight minutes have elapsed here in the first. The Flames lead 1-0. Puck drop, face off one, and the winger stepped right in. It's dumped in. Smart recovery by Stone. Motors along up the middle. And he dumps it in. Trying to go to Kamenov. It's dumped in. That is up close and personal. He's certainly on a mission out there. He's trying to set a tone for his team in what should be a really physical contest. Slides it to the point. And at an angle to Lindholm. That puck struck him in front. Trying to get rid of that puck. Pitching it to Bork. And he steps in. Let's it go. You can almost count that one, but no, what a save. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Critical win of the draw. Nicely received at the point. Propelled to Kachuk. What a terrific opportunity. Shot may not have intended it, but it hit it. Puck is thrown to Landeskog. Colorado's carrying it on through center ice. Chip to Johnson. Off the mark. Wicked shot there. That's why I wasn't a goalie, Doc. Passing one off now to Backlund. Wow, that should be a penalty. And yes, they are going to call that one. Well, I guess so. The Avs get a minor penalty for charging. Too many strides taken, Doc, while making contact. The Flames have practiced the power play feverishly this week. Let's see if it pays off. Well, the power play's excited to get out there. Those guys just about scrambled onto the ice as they get their initial chance of this game. Got it back out of the zone. Passed it ahead where there is some space. Around through the corner. Cuts off the passing lane in the defensive zone. Let's a shot fly. Save. The Flames lug the puck in the defensive zone. Let's it go. At least he protected his goaltender. Calgary's power play did not do it for them. Pass attempt to Neal. Got it in his own end. Snapping a pass to Goudreau. Crosses that line. Couldn't get through and retain possession. Let's it go. Outstanding save. What magic to even get the shot away. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Smith stretched out as far as he could go. He just got a chunk of that shot. the draw and the teammate puts the grab on it carries it on in from center loose puck due to the play by Wilson that was the wall that stopped that one is pointed to him on to Valamaki intercepted that one at an important place they can't be that sloppy with the puck guys every time they get it. Score! And this one is tied!
Well, that certainly changes the complexion of the game. That time goal has changed everything about this one. Calgary's got it off the draw at center. Looking to Neal. Nearing the last minute of play in the first. And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. Joseph is a dangerous player in the regular season. He's a dangerous player in the playoffs when it's far more difficult to score. He never stops working. And so if he's away from the net, somehow he pulls his way to the front for a rebound if it's available. Waffle boarded. One minute left. In the first period. He hangs on and gets the whistle. A well, shooter can't do much more than that, guys. That's an excellent shot that he delivered to the net, but the goaltender makes the save. The Avs with a clean win on the draw. Is able to move on in. Gathered up again by Gabriel Landeskog. Wonderful chance was set up and the pass just goes wide. Fires right in that catching glove. Good work. And so we've completed one period of play. Both teams caused the goaltenders to buckle only one time. So the goalies almost won that period. It's 1-1 one, one after one. Hey, hockey fans, follow the team all season long on the radio for every minute of play-by-play -play action. The Avs got this goal late in the period, and that tied the game. So they are on an upswing as we go to break. Begun and the scoreboard shows this thing tied. He's got that pass at the point. Missed the net. He's got one of the harder shots in the league, Doc. Steps in from the neutral zone. Fires one. Great save. Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in play. Colorado's got that face-off win. He was standing in the lane and got some up. Puck's loose, denied by the roadblock. Intercepts that pass. Maybe he can generate something. Directing that one to Goudreau. Laid on to Brody. And down to Lindholm. Slid to Gerard. Steps across that line. Dogged determination there by Brody. Couldn't retain possession. And decides to just cover it up and get the whistle. As soon as the shooter starts to release this, the goalie drops to the butterfly. Hey, buddy, pick up your head. You might see he's down on his knees already. Over three minutes have passed. We are at one goal apiece. Colorado's got another win. Back to the point. Capel to Barry. Back in his own end, having some problems. Driving in from no man's land. Cut that pass in his own end. Chip to Kerfoot. A good stick there, so no complete pass. To Kachuk. Moving it to Hamannick. And they are in. Takes that pass. 
shoots it off. Swept aside. Solid clean win. Colorado's in control of the puck and neutralize. Trying for it. Didn't have time, but he saved it anyway. That is a great display of goaltending there, Doc. He's got that point pass. The abs recoiling back in their own end. I'd say this game has played out pretty much according to plan. Both teams have been really focused on the defensive side of the puck. There's not much room. It has been pretty physical, and when there are chances, the goalies have been sharp. A howitzer got a piece of that one. He gets that squeeze in those pads and plays stop. Well, the goaltender read this really well. He's down in the butterfly, and he's going to stop this all day. Quick on the draw. Passes into unhindered terrain. Up to the point. Shoots that pass ahead. Puck picked up here. Centers it. He had the goalie beat and hit the iron. Banks it ahead to Borg. Takes a chance on the dump to the opposite corner. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Save there. Now it's directed to Lindholm. Shoots one. A good stick stop. That play has been blown dead, though it's difficult to know why. Apparently, the referee just lost sight of it. Barlamov's lucky. Just got a piece of that, but it was enough to make the stop. That's a face-off win. Gains that offensive line. Solid work there by Landeskog. Right to the point. Great defensive poke. And a save. Nice work by Gabriel Landeskog. Puck ricocheted off the screen. Gives it to the point. On the outside, a shot. Wonderful stop. Cut that pass in his own end. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Got the pad on that one. Pitching this one to Goudreau. The Flames skated up on the side. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Can start the attack going in the zone. Gathered up again by Bennett. Trying to go to Monaghan. And in flight over the line. Let's a shot go. Wonderful save with the glove. Shot, point blank save. That great save was all positioning. To Bennett, solid glove save. Arlamov's playing net better than anyone right now. He's doing whatever it takes to keep the puck out of the net. Critical win where they need it. A long scorcher! That's a good save and goal. They're going to have to come up with something better than that. Colorado's setting up an offense from the wing. Pitching it to Froelich. Loose puck, it went off somewhere. Puck is thrown to Calvin. Gets in, looks over his options here. Flings it, stick to some. Oh, 
Well, guys, that looked from my vantage point like it was going to go in. When the puck changed directions, it became a very difficult save for the goalie. A little over four minutes still showing on the clock this period. Scrappy game. Both of these teams have connected once. Colorado's got it. Tremendous hit. I wonder if that hit will change the momentum of this game. Terrific determination by James Neal. Possession taken behind the net. Play stopped. That puck is just him. Neal's skating ability allowed him to really put a lot of force in behind that big hit. The Avs with a face-off win. That puck's loose, defended away by Johnson. Marvelous save, no time on that one. A quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. ahead. Shoots. Wonderful stop. Passing one off now to Valimaki. And he steps across the line. Sends to the point. Fires. Turned away with the stick. Just couldn't make it. Colorado's looking to head man up the wing. And he dumps it in. The clock continues to get to the smaller numbers here, but there may be time for another rush. Let's it go. Save. Two periods are in the books here, and the books could very well have some perspiration stains on it by now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. Two period shots on goal totals read like this. 21 for the Flames and 12 for Colorado. The Avs are getting a tremendous performance in goal tonight, even though offensively they haven't been strong. He's kept them in here, and here's one example. We'll return after these words. Coaches probably said, who's going to get me that tiebreaker? Maybe they'll say, who's going to get me the OT winner? Pass attempt to Brody. The Flames with a neutral zone possession along the way. Got that pass in his own end. On to Landeskog. Snapping a pass to Giordano. The Flames have it along the side at mid ice Looking to Gerard, directing that one to McKinnon. In with it now. Regathers it. Takes it right back. He wore that puck on a hard shot. Moving it to Monaghan. Now it's directed to Goudreau. Fires! Great work with the pad. He covers and holds on. The face-off, the tie-up, and a solid job from the winger there. Brings it in for an attack. Shoots. Loud pad save. Pitching this one to Bennett. Hammers his way up the wing at neutral ice. Handled in the corner by Bennett. Trying to go to Jost. 
A quick turnover by the defense. Can they keep it going here? Gathered up again by Barrett. Pitching it to Kerfoot. Strike that one at center ice. Puck is thrown to Kachuk. Laid on to Backlund. Score! He got iron with that shot. Excited here. They've broken the tie. They've got the lead. But now you have to concentrate and get right back down to work. The Flames have scored an important goal. They now lead by one. There's still time left, but the advantage so far has been with them in time of possession. The tie up. He needed help, and he got it. It's dumped in. It up back there. Number 55, Noah the app skated up on the side. Terrific determination by Calvert. He's got that pass off the wing and can move ahead. Skill play by Neal. Passing one off now to Ryan. A shot. Terrific shot, but a great point blank save. He's locked in now. Great save. Moved along and in. Tries to get it on net. That puck was obstructed by a screen. Good, solid defense there. Oh, broke it up. Good defensive read with that one. Pitch back in from center. More time for player changes. Puck free, roadblock by Bork. And he dumps it in. Pass attempt to Kamenov. Looking to them. That pass is cut. Spirited back along, and they can get the forwards off anyway. And the pickup. Dumped in. Smart recovery by Stone. Calgary's continuing on up the wing. Puck loose. Good defensive play. And drives on through center. He takes that point pass. A shot that went way off the mark. This was a heavy shot, but it had no chance of going in because it missed the net. That puck is free. Went off somebody. Battle for possession, and it's kicked away by Johnson. Snapping a pass to Gerard. Leads that charge into the zone. Flings it, turned away with the stick. I know lots of people like high-scoring games. Well, actually, I'm one of them. But this has been almost like a well-played chess match. There's no room, there's no way that either team can find a way to get many more chances than there's been. Calgary's played very well in this tight game. Their goaltender's going to have to stay sharp. He's not had a lot of shots to deal with, Doc. A little under seven minutes remaining here in the third. Once we were tied. Maybe we'll be tied again. Gets that one on a cross. Really good cut of the pass. Giordano's got to be able to complete that pass. Certainly with his team ahead, that puck has to at least go forward. Skill play by Cole. Directing that one to Kerfoot. He's got that one. Let's see what happens. Nice save there. They're going to have to do better than that to beat him. Moving it to Goudreau. Pass cut by the offense. Rister, save! The Flames with control at center ice. Good shooting place. Well done with that pass. Now it's directed to Kerfoot. Slid to McKinnon. Propelled to Barry. Not on the net. Instead, it's won. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Two guys together with force. Big force. This just continues what he's done throughout the previous part of the game. He's been on the body from the very beginning. 
Now he's trying to spark his team as they need to come back to get themselves into the game. Smith's going to be able to make that save all day. His positioning is perfect. It's not a difficult scoring chance. The goalie's far and away been the best player in this hockey game. He has faced an inordinate amount of shots in this contest, stopped just about everything, and as a result, he's got to be the first star as his team is leading this game. Colorado's moving the puck up the wing. Using the point. Right into the slot. That was a great play and goal. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. Puck went just outside the blue line, and so everybody has to get back. Good place to shoot from. Score! And the game is even. Approaching the final minute in this game. And possession has changed. Brilliant move on that pass. He's got it. Colorado's in control as they travel up the wing. Gathered up by Stone. Skating up the center zone wing. That's the end. Good work by Bennett. Pitching this one to Calvert. The Avs are at the wing in neutral ice. Right in front. Wonderful work in close and a brilliant save. You talk about cutting down the angle. Perfectly executed by the goaltender. Collected by Stone. Good intercept in his own end. The Avs up the wing lug the puck. Chip to Bork. Let's it go. Three periods didn't prove a thing. It's going to take overtime. The Stars will have to give more, and so will everyone else. The shots on goal are high already, and they're going to crawl higher after three periods. 26 for Calgary and 21 for the Avalanche. Colorado's goal has forced the overtime period. Take a look at it one more time. Who will get the next one? We'll find out when overtime begins in a moment. Who will the hero be? That puck went loose off the enemy. Lugged along the line. Fires. Oh, and he missed the net. Well, that's a good scoring chance. He's trying to be too fine, trying to pick the corner. Sometimes you've just got to shoot it at the middle of the net. To be a top 10 scorer in the playoffs requires a couple things. Your team has to be good, so you play enough games to get into the top 10. But also, you have to be able to produce when the level of the game is risen. Calgary's got that puck off the draw. The Flames wheel it up the wing. Points it. And they've got it again. Stick handles up the wing at center. Calgary is carrying it in their own zone. It is hard work here to get the puck free. Trying to go to Lindholm. Near the boards. 
gains the zone. One into another. Oh, that is a great hit. I love that hit. In the open ice, you really send a message with one of those. Let's a shot fly. Didn't miss by much. There's not really much place to go with the shot. He's trying to be perfect. He misses, and the puck rings around the boards. Calgary's lugging it up the wing. Shoots one. That one's deflected. Ooh, what a break. Shot hit the man. Pitching it to Jost. It's an onside play. Nice tip of the pass. Things are heating up with that hit. Puck is thrown to Bennett. Takes it from the boards and looks on. On to Bennett. Has that point pass as well. There's a shot that's way wide. I'm sure he meant well. They did everything right there except hit the net. He gets that pass ahead in stride. That shot came from right in front. You got to find a way to put it in the net. Looking from the corner. Puts one on. Great save. Makes the stop and holds for the whistle. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Over seven minutes play. We are at two goals apiece. Defensive zone win. Starts a breakout by passing ahead of the play. To the point it comes. Scooped up by Calvin. Loose puck, good defensive denial. He gains the zone. So Leak's got to try to simplify his game there. Just too much stick handling. Wonderful block. Didn't get a thing of that one. Puck picked up here. Pass cut. Took it up the boards and holds. Let's it go. A wonderful scoring chance denied. Look at how active the goaltender is looking around the screen to try to make the stop. Stole that pass away in his own end. Taken away. Gains the blue line. Corral brings a shot. Back on his stick. Passing one off now to Andrighetto. Pass. Makes that play deep. And he gains the zone. Got it at the point. Good intercept. Pass attempt to McKinnon. Into the attacking end. Laid on to Gerard. A shot. Terrific save with no reaction time whatsoever. Looking to Goudreau. Puck loose, just a speed bump off the defense. Shot on. Blockered away. And ring more bells on that one. One after another. Has it in his own end. Onside. Let's it go. He's held up against the boards. Kicks and escapes by Hammond. Just missed the net. From that position on the ice, he's got to hit the net. Make the goalie make a save. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. Didn't go very well. Score! And the overtime is finished. It went to overtime, and the winning team has now tied the series. Oh, has this ever developed into something special? Both teams not giving their opponents much to work with. We had to go to overtime in order to close this out. With the series tied, it could still go either way.
No time like playoff time. See you next time. Good night, all.